going on now. It's your boy Mount Moves. We're about to get off the bus. We're going to get to the studio. We're going to see what's happening in there. And then I'll be able to tell y'all a little bit more of what's going on for this video today. All I know is we got a big day ahead of us and I'm super excited. I only got like five hours of sleep today. But I uh, made it on time. So, you guys are ready? Let's see what's up! Thank you. <laughs> the brother man, you know we had to come. What's up, what's your name? Pay homage to the greats. Everybody who came before you. And then, of course, the studio. I'm like, if I'm going to be a rapper, it's the least of your concerns. I was like, yeah, mom. You got to be like, mom, I'm about to get a lot of women pregnant. So, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's, that's what you got to worry about, mom. Not smoking on camera. Ain't nobody worried about that. Smoking on camera. What about these babies you going to take care of? <laughs> Talk about you need some grandchildren. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Man, this is start the artistry. Mom, say, Mom, I'm being an artist just to have them grandkids for you, Mom. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna have like seven. <laughs> just for you, Mom. Just for you, yeah. Mama. Man, we could save a lot of kids' lives, bro. I have no idea. Especially in Dave, bro. Especially in Dave. <clears throat> Dave County is where it's at. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to the need. I know when I was a kid, I remember when like people that was in my position you know what i'm saying like came back and and contributed to the neighborhood and contributed to the youth and shit like that like that right there that was a lasting memory for me you know what i'm saying i looked at that situation as like i have to make it just to give back you know what i'm saying it wasn't even the fact that i have to make it you know what i'm saying to kind of take care of myself it was just more so that i realized the impact that it had on me and I wanted to have that same impact for somebody else. You know what I'm saying? And that, that right there, man, is a testament, man. It's just we just gotta keep working, keep grinding, man, and just keep keep pushing and keep doing, man. People be going through hard times, man. It still, it still shouldn't stop you from helping somebody. You know what I'm saying? Facts. And it's like it still shouldn't. You know what I mean? I don't been homeless before. You know what I'm saying? I don't lost the club. I don't lost all type of businesses. Dog dealing with people that has selfish ways and I still managed to bounce back, you know what I mean? Like, still helping people, you know what I'm saying? So it's just one of those things, uh, like, if you live life right, man, you know what I mean? Like, no matter what you go through, dog, you know what I'm saying? It's always gonna be something that that comes along the way and, and helps, you know what I'm saying? Or puts you in a, a better situation, but you just can't give up on yourself, you know what I'm saying? Never give up. Especially when you when you being perpetrated by people outside forces that are beyond your control. You know what I'm saying? If it's beyond your control, that doesn't mean you give up. It's beyond your control. You know what I'm saying? Those are the those are the moments that you you really fight the hardest, you know what I'm saying? Because you wanna control everything. You wanna be able to control your own destiny. You know what I'm saying? So you fight for that. You gotta fight for that. Because I told him, I said, we have programs where we teach people how to engineer. He's like, he's like, just that word alone, you know what I'm saying? Because engineering comes with a whole bunch of different aspects of it, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And um, so he's like, the funding for just any project that we do, that's why it's so important that we start yeah. doing projects now. Because we, if we can get some funding to really help these kids, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Not just start with the lap like the laptop the laptop giveaway is, is a good start. No, what the all the laptop thing is 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 letting the community know who creative room is creative youth is. Yeah. That's all it's doing. That's all it's gonna do. And which is a big thing. You know what I'm saying? And cause there's nothing like when you actually see the uh, organization out there doing it. Something. You know what I'm saying? It's a difference between okay, you going ahead and you got it on website and all that stuff, but when you actually see somebody doing it, it's a whole nother bracket right there. So, 
Definitely. Man, that's what's up. Let me go uh, check on the van real quick, man. Nah, anyway, I got a car. No, no, you don't. You don't see why. <laughs> Right, yo, we can change generations, we can change generations, and the only way we can change generations is through connectivity. But if we don't, if we don't meet these standards, and every time we get screwed over, and, or this and that, and oh, we, oh, I'm just not gonna connect no more because I'm just done, I done got screwed over. You know how I many times I done got screwed over in business? It doesn't stop you from connecting. You just can't connect with those particular people. You know what I mean? But you still have to connect. You still have to build. And if you want to change shit 300 years down the, down the line, you need to create a, a network, a web, an inexplicable web of humanity. You know what I'm saying? Or not even humanity, an inexplicable web of, of community. Community. A, a network community yeah. of, of your, your community. And then you make sure that community eats. And if you're are fortunate enough to expand that community as soon as you make that community eat or whoever in that community eats they go off and branch off and create their own network and web of community that alone will trickle down but it has to start somewhere and somebody has to know how to create that web one share brings it to how many other people and if one person shares from that one share it's all going to keep going that same way and that's how things get viral same things, things get built. Mm -hmm. Can't build a business and then just allow that one business to thrive when there's opportunities and outlets to make multiple businesses become a corporation. But it starts with a network of community. Community of understanding. Community of communication. You know what I'm saying? Everybody communicating on what is transpiring, what they're doing, what they can do to help what they can do to the to avoid certain roadblocks that might be set forth. But how are we gonna know that if we don't communicate? Help. Caught him on 25th, we gon' whack her all, drop her all, roll him in the guard, we gon' pass the guard. Y'all already know the chop stick and hang real far. Got green beans, red beans, hit you in your heart. Got the 30 on the 48, finna do a crime, we gon' give her how they come and get them pussy niggas dying. Smoking. Cousin niggas don't want no smoke, niggas get to choking If you fuck with my bros, pull up on your bro We gon' up the smoke, hey, got a 38 It's gon' broke your nose uh. Niggas talking on the game, we gon' leave that nigga slain I ain't playing with these niggas that keep talking on my name Me and bro switching lanes, you already know I'm bringing pain, nigga, I'm uh, bringing yeah. pain yeah. Man, I'm sliding with the pole, I hit you on your nose You know I be throwing foes and I fuck with them zoes If you pull up on my block, we can hit you with a Glock 20 shots, hack your fuck again, we gon' pop your top, yeah Pop your top, yeah What's up, 
people, it's your boy Mountain Blues here. Had a long day, did a lot of dope things. Ended up meeting some super cool kids who got to rap and freestyle for me. Apparently I might be making a music video for him. Um, I'm about to get to the Pompano train station, so we're gonna get off this train and then we're gonna make our way home eventually. We're gonna edit this thing up and then we'll get to see everything. So, yeah, it's And just like that, your boy's on his way home. My boy Coach, he watching me on Instagram live right now while I'm freestyling. You know, this man's straight family out here, bro. You gonna see. I'm about to get on. He about to get on live. Okay, that's what's up. Send me the request, bro. I could request you. I think. Yeah, I could just add you. That's my dog right here. Yeah, shit popping. What up, man? I'm doing well, brother. How you doing? Man, rolling up. <laughs> How's the studio? How's the studio treating you? Huh? How's the studio treating you? Bruh, I haven't really been, uh, I haven't been in the studio in a minute. My cousin just be sending me tracks trying to get off the business phone. Really? Yeah, man, my cousin, he's a little producer from Los Angeles. I mean, he's moving around here from here and now. Um, we just came from Arizona doing some shit, but yeah, that nigga, he's nice, he's been doing tracks since he was like 12. Say word. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm gonna see you up here. Okay. Listen, I'm I'm rapping on my buddies right now, so like I'm all about like listen, I'm gonna try to come out with EPs like every month if I can. Like depending on how long this quarantine comes out, I'm gonna have an EP out by the end of this month. Like, I'm not playing right now. Bro, the best thing I've learned, especially with music, is consistency, bro. And just putting out stuff. If you can put out, if you keep on putting out stuff, no matter if the people like it or not, they gonna, they, 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 I mean, they still gonna gravitate to it. People gonna listen. That's how we be, that's how these songs that's not that good, you be singing them, be, be, that's because people push it on. Songs on you, and people keep putting it out, and, and, and shit, at one point, you don't have no choice but to get it. Hmm. Ain't lying. So as long as you can put your shit out, bro, that shit gonna happen. Ain't lying. He ain't lying. That's what's up. Hey, bro, but... Like, bro, Say it again? Like, like bro, I was telling my girl, most of these rappers you hear out here, dog, they not overnight success. Like, they not overnight success. Like, they been rapping for 10 years, and they still ain't overnight success. Like, they been rapping for 10 years before you didn't hurry them. Niggas like Kevin Gates and... and, and shit, and even, even Wiz Khalifa. They been rapping for years, man. Even Wiz, bro. Yeah, 